If you have lamps in your attic, piles of leaves, or a sofa you've been meaning to take to the dump, Macon Bibb Solid Waste Department has pledged to pick it up for free. Their holiday cleanup drive starts tomorrow and goes through December. Abby Casoros explains how the county hopes to encourage people to clean up their homes and their neighborhoods. We kind of just moved in not too long ago. DeMonte Reeves still has some of his moving boxes on his curb, along with a mattress waiting for the Solid Waste Department to pick it up. They come when they're supposed to and they usually pick up everything. Advanced Disposal empties your trash cans, but Macon Bibb's Solid Waste Department is responsible for bulky items like mattresses and yard waste. There's usually a fee for those larger items, but he's in luck. The county is hosting a holiday cleanup event where they're waiving those fees. Each neighborhood will be given a week where they will get free pickup. It's supposed to prevent a bigger mess. This is what we call an illegal dump site. Pat Rains, the head of the Bibb County Solid Waste Department, says cleanup will also deter people from dumping their trash and causing entire roads to be blocked with discarded mattresses, TVs, and furniture. We have one five minutes away from here in Bloomfield. We uh, Public Works has just done one over in East Macon on, a, on Center Street. That was the street you couldn't even get down. The Solid Waste Department and Public Works both work together to clean up the mess. But Rains says she hopes this will encourage people to get rid of everything they have and take pride in their community. It'll help with clearing out, like, you know, addicts and, like, getting things out of people's basements. Reeves says he has more stuff he could probably throw away, so it's looking like the perfect time for some pre-holiday cleaning. In Macon, Abby Casores, 13 WMAZ News. County spokesman Chris Flores says they're scheduling neighborhoods on a weekly basis. For a link to find out when your neighborhood is scheduled and a list of items the county will and will not pick up, go to 13WMAZ.com.